Hello, and welcome to another tiny video. Today I'm going to show you how you can review intelligence and national security studies using rebus puzzles. I think this will help them recall prior knowledge because there is a lot of information when you're just talking about the history of intelligence and then when you lead into the different ints and um, how those intelligence disciplines have uh, evolved over time, there's definitely a lot of information. So um, this is a recommendation of how to uh, help them recall some of the um, key talking points or information that may be helpful for them. And then also an opportunity to facilitate some friendly competition and follow on discussion. So here are four of the Rebus puzzles that I'll have um, within a, a PowerPoint presentation that I'll post in the intelligence group in the Godot community. So this will give you an opportunity to have an activity just to use. Uh, but these are four, so I'm gonna give you a second to see if you can figure out what they are. And then I'm gonna pop up the answer and show how you can actually use a follow-on question to help them recall prior knowledge. All right, are you ready? Okay. The first one is checks and balances. So they can actually explore pieces of legislation that have been created over time and you can specifically ask them to recall one. Ready for the second one? This one should be probably pretty easy. Top secret. Then you can ask additional questions such as what are the other types of classifications and what do they mean? Ready for the next one? Forgotten heroes. So they can explain the contributions of a prominent figure in US intelligence. This is uh, wide open because you can focus on um, different groups of people that have contributed to uh, the history of US intelligence. You can split that down by the different intelligence disciplines and then ask them to think about people that they learned and studied about during um, the different ints discussion. So that question there, um, that can generate a lot of good discussion. And then lastly, this one you should get really quickly. Too big to ignore, right? So what are some of the most important technological accomplishments across the intelligence disciplines that are too big to ignore. Um, again, in studying the history, you can even break this out into the different periods of history and how some technology um, that was developed helped turn the tables um, during a particular conflict. So again, lots of valuable information and great opportunities to discuss. Um, some of the prior knowledge that your students have gained. Again, I will have a PowerPoint presentation posted in the intelligence group within Godot community, and I welcome you to use it. Uh, so thank you very much for your time and attention. Have a good one.